What's up guys? Today we're going to talk about uh, the benefits of buying through a wholesaler versus uh, going on the MLS and buying a property through an agent. So as uh, a wholesaler, a general overview of, of what we do is we market heavily to off-market uh, homeowners and then we find motivation through those homeowners and then what we do is we negotiate terms and price to help them get out of their sticky situations that they have with their property. So what that allows us to do is focus on getting deals and helping people out of their property and in turn we can turn around and sell properties to investors or buy them ourselves and we can get those properties generally at a discount versus selling those properties retail because usually the properties that we're buying are in the stress. Uh, they're not usually fixed up houses. Uh, they're market ready for the MLS. So uh, the first benefit of buying through a, through a wholesaler is the specialization. Uh, like I mentioned before, uh, we handle all the marketing. We handle negotiations, the contracts. That's what we specialize in. Uh, that allows you as the buyer to focus on what you do best. So that turns into convenience for you all, which is step number two or benefit number two. Uh, if you're an investor, if you're flipping properties, that allows you to go focus on uh, building out your crews, finding contractors, uh, managing materials and contractors and contracts uh, for those people, and then focus on getting paid as well. If you're a landlord, that allows you to only focus on rehabbing your properties, managing your tenants, and collecting cash flow. You don't have to worry about going out and finding properties, spending money on marketing, and trying to negotiate these deals down, and deal with the, I guess, dynamics of all the different situations that we as wholesalers uh, deal with on a daily basis to get these properties under contract and find them. Uh, the third one is a more streamlined process. So uh, if you go through a traditional route of purchasing a property uh, with a real estate agent, what you're gonna do is you are going to deal with uh, a long drawn out process. You have lots of contract work, lots of paperwork. Uh, you have to go try to impress a bank uh, and get financing. Sometimes you don't get financing on the first try. It may take 10 tries, 20 tries, 30 tries to continue to get financing. Uh, that's a long drawn out process. They make you go through uh, pretty strenuous inspections. They want appraisals. Uh, they want all this stuff to justify uh, you buying that property and being able to afford it and it actually appraising for the value and being worth what you're paying for. Uh, that's a good thing. However, if you are an experienced buyer, uh, you can come in and buy through a wholesaler and kind of bypass all of that stuff. Uh, we really shorten down. Uh, we don't have, we have like one or two page contract. Uh, that's all you have to deal with. Uh, inspection periods are compressed. Uh, you don't have to deal with a very drawn out inspection period. Uh, generally the people that we work with know what is wrong with the property. They know what's going to take to fix that problem and they know how much it's going to cost uh, as soon as they walk through and see the property. Uh, they don't need a really uh, in-depth inspection period. Uh, the other thing is the financing, like I mentioned, trying to get financing, the closing, uh, sometimes closing, uh, from our experience, when we were buying retail properties, uh, closing can be drawn out. You get approved, uh, then you have to keep submitting paperwork. Uh, sometimes the seller doesn't want to close on time. Uh, it just extends the period. It's a big headache. However, on the flip side, if you go through a wholesaler, uh, we can close in seven to 30 days. Uh, we can close quickly. Uh, inspection periods are short. Uh, you can get in and out very quickly. Uh, so the fourth item is the opportunity of buying through a wholesaler versus retail. Uh, if you go through retail, generally, you are going to be paying the market value for that property. However, if you go buy through a wholesaler, you're going to be getting uh, discounted property. So generally, you're going to get uh, anywhere from 50 to 70 to 80 percent off. Uh, deals vary on the situation. So if you get that discounted price off your properties they're buying, it allows you to buy 
more properties. Uh, it allows you to reduce the risk. So if you're paying $100,000 for retail properties, but in turn you can go buy two properties from a wholesaler for $50,000, $60,000 each, you get double the property for roughly the same cost, if not the same cost. That also allows you to mitigate your risk. You can buy more properties and pay less for them. So uh, if the market turns, you have more equity in your properties, you're not going to be affected as much. Uh, your cash flow will be greater because you've paid less for the property. Your mortgage is usually uh, lower than if you go through a retail purchase strategy. Uh, that allows you to have more cushion on your monthly payments and expenses. So there's lots of benefits to buying through a wholesaler. If you want to learn more about the process and what we can offer you and our deals that we have, go on our website, fill out the forms, get signed up for our buyers list, or give us a call at the number listed below. Thanks guys.